Unforgettable stories out of Western Jamaica from the scrapbooks of Adrian Freita. Negril, arguably the most precious gem in Jamaica's tourism crown, is best known globally for its seven miles of white sand beaches and the hospitality of its people. Negril, which came to the fore as a premier tourism destination in the 1960s, it's a place where numerous North American tourists have come to over the years and have decided to make it their home, never to return from whence they came. While Negril has never been totally isolated from Jamaica's crime problem, crime was never seen as a major issue as the incidents were few and far between. However, all that changed in June 2017 when Negril witnessed one of the most horrifying murders that has ever taken place in Jamaica. A young man who had created a video which had gone viral in which he boasted of being a heartless killer slaughtered his 24 year old girlfriend and buried her under the floor of his bedroom. These are one of those haunted, isn't it? Yo girl, and I understand my girl. Yo, my love laugh and think, well yo, there's total different sides of me and I understand there's an evil side and there's a good side. It is also believed that he murdered the woman's four-year-old daughter and disposed of her body because the child has not been seen since that gruesome incident. The man behind that gruesome killing was identified as Ayele Russell, who was living in the West End section of Negril at the time of the killing. Russell, who was apprehended five years after the killing, confessed to murdering 24-year-old Nadine Dyer, but never accounted for her baby daughter, Orlando Malcolm, who went missing at the time. After the killing, Russell fled to New York where he surfaced on April 23rd, 2017. Shortly after arriving there, he was arrested and charged with second degree robbery and sent to prison for a five year sentence. After his sentence was completed, Russell was deported from the United States back to Jamaica on July 29, 2021. Within two days of returning to the island, he confessed to the murder of Daya and was subsequently convicted and sentenced to life imprisonment. In this edition of Lest You Forget, we will be revisiting that horrifying story from a story I wrote for the Gleaner, which was published on February 26, 2018, under the headline, Alleged Negro Killer in Custody in New York. The story read as follows. A yearly rustle. The Negro resident who allegedly murdered his girlfriend last year and buried her body beneath the floor of his bedroom in the West End section of Resort Town is now in custody in the United States where he is reportedly facing a robbery charge. Based on the information on the New York Department of Corrections website, Russell, who is wanted by the Jamaican police in connection with the death of his girlfriend, Nadian Dyer, was arrested on February 12th and charged with second-degree robbery. He has since appeared in court and was remanded at Otis Bannam Correctional Center in New York. This is fantastic news. When we heard he was in custody, it was the best news possible, a resident of Negril told the Gleaner yesterday. This is a man who does not deserve to experience freedom for the rest of his life. According to reports, shortly after 24-year-old Nadia Dyer and her 3-year-old daughter Orlando Malcolm went missing, Russell was observed bringing construction material into his house. When quizzed about his activities, he reportedly said that he was constructing a fish tank. However, in June, acting on a tip, the police went to Russell's house and breached the door to his room where they were greeted by a foul smell and blood splattered on the wall. Following a search of the room, a grave was found under the bed covered with concrete. When the grave was dug up, Daya's body was found. It is still unclear what became of the child who went missing alongside Daya. Efforts by the police to find Russell were unsuccessful. Subsequent reports suggested that he had fled the island shortly after he completed the so-called construction work at his house. 
a video subsequently surfaced showing Russell brandishing at least two firearms and telling an unknown female that he is a man with two distinct personas, good and evil. Me is a man who just haunted. You see me, girl? You don't understand me. Girl, me love laugh and thing. But yo, there's a totally different side of me. There's an evil side and there's a good side. Me love you. Me love you. Me really love you. Russell explained in the video while holding a high power weapon close to the camera. When the police era one headquarters was contacted yesterday to find out if they were aware that Russell was in custody in New York, the Gleaner was told that the commanding officer was in a meeting. However, another usually reliable police source said he was unaware of Russell's arrest and would pass on the information to his superior. Based on information posted on the New York Department of Corrections website, Russell is slated to make his next court appearance on March 15. Russell was subsequently found guilty and sentenced to a five-year prison term. He has since completed his sentence and was deported back to Jamaica, where he is now languishing in a prison cell facing justice for the murder of Dyer whose baby daughter still remains unaccounted for. In looking back at this heartbreaking incident, there is absolutely no question that this is one of those unforgettable stories out of Western Jamaica. Unforgettable stories out of Western Jamaica from the scrapbooks of Adrian Freita. Before you go, please remember to subscribe. He's a man who just haunted, isn't it? Yo, girl, you don't understand me, girl. Yo, I love laugh and think. Oh, yo, there's total different sides of me, and I understand there's an evil side and there's a good side. I love her. I love her. I really do love her. And it's a bad one. You know? Man, mad thing, you know? Mm -hmm. Yo, clean, you know? Mm-hmm. See on it, you know? Bad. Rarity, man. You hear that? Fire. I don't know if I hear that. I don't know that's a slick up, you know? Yeah. Mad machine, man. Sick. Bad. You know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, guys are general. Really sweet, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But I'm sure a lot of kind. I want a kind dog, you know? Sick specials. Yeah, kind of enough. Buy some extra car and run for the block. I'll keep it right now. Keep it going one more now. Mm -hmm. See it? Screw the spring force to your seat. Mm 